Hello, I'm Joanna Jana, and I have taught second grade at Columbia Elementary for 39 years. Um, in fact, I was a kindergartner when Columbia was brand new, and that dates me a little bit. Um, it has been a, a great teaching experience. I received my uh, degree from Ball State University, my undergraduate work, and then I went to Indiana University to get my master's um, in, t in elementary ed also. But I do think that teaching is quite a family thing. Uh, my dad, Paul Rockwell, taught for 40 years, and many of those were in the Rochester schools. My brother, Spike Rockwell, taught biology. And currently, my daughter, Kristen Jana, is teaching first grade at North Miami. So we definitely have a line of, of teachers. Um, when asked what my most memorable moment was from teaching, there are so many that I can't just single one out. Uh, it's, it's been a wonderful career. I've met a lot of wonderful students, a lot of, of wonderful coworkers along the way. Many of my coworkers uh, that I started with have retired. There are very few left in the building. Um, so I, I really can't single out one particular thing that it was uh, most memorable. Um, when I was asked what the most satisfying thing about being a teacher is, I would have to say that every year you have new faces, you have new challenges, new goals, and the growth from the beginning of the year until the end of the year is amazing. And whether you've taught one year or 39 years, uh, every year you're just in awe at the end at how much they've learned. And uh, so that's been very, very rewarding. And not only just the, the academics, but their social growth too. And that's imp an important part. What will I miss most about teaching? Um, the children. Um, they're delightful and uh, I will miss them. Um, spending my time after retirement, I plan to travel with my husband Wayne, um, visit our children that live out of town, and uh, spend more time in my yard and my flower garden and get out on Lake Manitow during the week when it's not quite so busy. And I will look forward to that. And I think one of the most important things is uh, I'm going to enjoy not setting that alarm clock because I'm tired of going to bed when I, because I have to and getting up because I have to. And so I look forward to that. Um, if I had any advice for younger teachers or people maybe wanting to go into the field, um, I would say first of all, you know, be sure they get a good solid background of the basics that they need to build on. And always remember that every child is unique. Every child wants to be loved praised and respected, and you can find the good in all children. And uh, there's a quote on my desk um, that I've had for a long, long time, and it says, in God's eyes, we all sparkle like the stars. And just keep that in mind. Thank you.